and Botai, uh, with regards to Saudat Purim, one of the primary mitzvot of Purim is to sit down and have a festive meal. Now, the parameters of the festive meal are as follows. What should a person eat? Lecha techila. A person wants to be yotze the mitzvah on the highest level. A person should have bread, meat, red meat, and wine at this seuda. According to many poskim, a person is not yotze with any other alcoholic beverage than wine. Because the nis was done with wine. Others disagree. But lecha techila, it should be with wine. So bread, meat, and wine. A level under. Even if you don't have bread. If it's not a bread meal, as long as you have meat and wine, you're still yotze. that's still the mitzvah of the puri meal. Now let's say a person doesn't like meat, or he can't, whatever it is, he's not some on kashrut, uh, whatever it is. He, he doesn't eat meat, he eats chicken, whatever it is. He can be yotze with chicken as well, but that's a lower level. Wine, let's say a person doesn't like wine. A person who doesn't like wine, he doesn't have to push himself to, to drink it, but lechatechila, you should get a, a wine that you, that you like in order to enjoy it. Now, the best time, the Mekubalim, it's brought down B'Shem Ariya Kadosh, the Rashash also brings it down, the Mekubalim have their Purim meal for breakfast, which means that they pray uh, on Purim morning, they have Mikra Megillah, immediately after Mikra Megillah, after the Tefillah, they give Matanot Le'Avionim, they give Mishloch Manot, and then right afterwards they sit down for their Seuda, Seudat Purim, the whole shebang, bread, meat, wine, right in the morning, and then they continue out, learning during the day, that was actually the minhag of Maran Zechon Barcha. He would have his Purim meal right after Shacharit on Purim. But again, not everybody's Mekubalim. It's okay. Meikar din you can have your, your meal anytime on Purim, anytime before Shkiah. Preferably you should have most of the Purim meal before Shkiah. Shkiah nowadays, after we change the clock, is about 7 o'clock. So you have plenty of time yeah, to have a majority of the meal before Shkiah. And also preferably many people pray min Chagidola before having the meal, because many posts can consider the Seudat Purim as a big meal. You're not allowed to have a big meal to sit down to bread and, and a Seudat Dola before you pray Mincha. So preferably you should pray Mincha beforehand and then Arvit after the Seudat. Now, uh, we'll continue speaking about the mitzvah of getting drunk on Purim. We'll speak about that tomorrow, Bezat Hashem, what the parameters of that mitzvah is. But let's put that on the side for now. Tomorrow morning, Bezat Hashem, is the fast, is Ta'anit Esther. The fast begins at 5.40 a.m. Fast ends tomorrow at 7.27 p.m. If you, uh, if you want to have something to eat or drink uh, before the fast, you should make a tonight. You should stipulate before you go to sleep tonight and say that I'm not beginning the fast. I don't accept the fast upon myself until Alot HaShachar. And if I wake up beforehand, I should be able to eat and drink. In which case, if you set an alarm and wake up, you'll be able to eat and drink whatever you want. Obviously, not a Seudat Keva. Um, depending on what time you get up, if it's close to Anot HaShachar, Yom Tov, Atzlachar.